Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So here are all of my bath bombs from 2018 and as you can see I did not use a lot of them, especially the new ones that came out much later in the year, but I hope to change that um, this year because I refuse to go through this again. This is just just way too much stuff, you know. Um, I am going to be filming this um, Lush collection upstairs in the loft, so it kind of sucks bringing all this stuff up the stairs. So, yeah, it's not fun. And right now, I got this bag full of jellies, and I just got the shower gels all put together. I have a space here and a space there because I have two of them in the shower, so I will grab those. So, it's currently what is it? It's Friday night, or I should say early Saturday morning. It's probably, I don't know, 1 o'clock a.m. And I am planning on doing this on Monday, because I do have a day off. But what happened is I found out that my boyfriend also has a day off. He usually doesn't, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do. I might have to do this late at night, which kind of sucks because it's not, you know, ugh, the lighting is so horrible upstairs. I was hoping that I could do it during the day and he did offer to um, leave for the day but I don't know. I don't know if I really want to do that. That's kind of mean. So yeah, I'm going to just start unpacking these and then I'll bring up the soaps but I won't put them away or you know start laying them on the ground and I have these sheets on the ground because um, I don't want all the cat hair on my products because I will be storing these back into my drawers. So, yeah, let's see um, if I can accomplish that. Gigi has tried a couple times to get um, on the sheets and just sniff the bath bombs and everything, but I'm like, no, go away. Shoo, shoo, shoo. So, yeah, I'm going to continue bringing stuff up and laying them on the floor and, yeah. So I just brought a little bit more upstairs. I brought the shower jellies, um, the lotions, the lip scrubs, all that good stuff. And tomorrow I will set up the soaps and the bubble bars. And oh, and also the massage bars, but I don't have a lot of that. And the day I film, I will take out the, what should I call it now? Um, oh gosh, it's so late, I can't even think. I will take out the... Um, bath oils and bath melts from um, that are in the fridge and I think I'll be all set for Monday. It's about 2.15 right now in the morning and I am so freaking tired. Like I need to get some sleep because I didn't get a lot of sleep this, um, this week at all. So I hope you guys are excited. So here are all of my bubble bars except for these three large bath bombs. And all fit into this one big box and I had my boyfriend carry it upstairs. What you doing, Luna? Hmm? Are you here to help me film my little Lush collection 2018? What you doing? Hey. Do you like Lush? <laughs> You're so cute. Say hello. <laughs> so in order for me to film this collection because I do have a lot and I honestly don't want to be boxed in, you know, just having everything all laid out and then not being able to reach it and film it. So I had to do it little by little. So I just finished doing the shower gels and now I'll be doing the shower jellies and then the lotions. And I'm just so embarrassed because I have way too many shower jellies and body lotions because I kind of forgot they were there. The shower gels are in front of the shower jellies, I tend to forget that they're there, and the lotions, yeah, I just forget they're there, so ugh, you'll see just how much crap I have. So take a look at this too. I have these two shower smoothies, Turkish Delight, you can look at, look, it's nice and solid, but then you go to the creamed almond and coconut, it is soupy, can you not see that? That is so weird. Yeah, so I just thought that was really interesting how totally 
liquidy this is as opposed to this one, which is nice and solid. Oh, look at her. She's taking a nap. She's keeping me company while I film this. So I just finished filming the shower jellies and now I'll be doing the lotions. But first, I have to make sure I secure the lids on these because I don't want to accidentally tip them over. And some of them, are, you know, they're a little bit runny. So I want to make sure that they're nice and tight and, um, you know, nicely secured. And this is my favorite, Santa's Jelly or Santa's Belly Shower Jelly. I think it's just so pretty. It has like glitter. I love the color. It's like a deep red. And on top of that, it has these pretty tiny, you know, gold stars embedded. It's just really, really pretty. And it smells good. So yeah, it's one of my favorite scents. So this body lotion here, the Calacus, it's almost gone, but you can see it's white. And then they came out with another version. And look at the color. It's a pretty neon green, neon yellow color. And over here is my charity pot that I got when I was in Germany. And I love it. It has some German words on here that I don't understand. And it's Dirty Girls of Lesbos. And I wanted to get one when I was in... Or I, didn't, I shouldn't say I wanted to get one. I was going to get one when I was in Norway. But I forgot. There was a Lush store. I think it was in down the subway station or something like that and I'm like okay I gotta make a point to come back I just don't want to get it right now and I never did I actually forgot and I, I'm really bummed about that because I do want to pick one up in every country that I go to if there is one you know nearby so I miss that opportunity because I don't know if I'll ever go back to Norway but I do want to go back to Norway and kind of do like a, a redo and do more of a nature type of travel because we mostly stayed in Oslo and really didn't do much outside the cities. And I think if you want to go to Norway, you want to do more of the nature stuff, the hiking. So, yeah, maybe one day. My least favorite lip scrub is easily the popcorn. I do not like it at all. So I'm trying to get rid of that first before starting on this one. And I'm working my way down um, the oldest to the newest. And here, this wasn't meant to be in my collection. This was sent to me by mistake. By Lush, I meant to. Uh, they meant to send me the chocolate lip scrub. Instead, they sent me this, but they did end up sending me um, a chocolate one down the road as a, I guess, as an apology for sending me this Temple Balm. So I don't, I, I won't use this one. I have no use for it. Um, I think this is the one that's supposed to energize you, as opposed to like if you have a headache, then you put this on your temples. But I could be wrong. What do you think? What do you think? Should I be done with this videotaping? So what do you think? Should I stop filming for now? It's time to go to bed. What do you think? Yeah? Wanna go to bed, honey? <laughs> You're so cute. Let's go to bed. Alright guys, I will pick this up tomorrow night. As it is past two o'clock in the morning so yeah time for bed look how can you resist this little girl I mean look she's so cute all right we'll go to bed so I just realized I need to move all these bath bombs way on top and I need to move them maybe like three or four rows at a time so I can show it to you so I can actually sit down as I don't know the way it's set up right now I can't sit down <laughs> no there's no way and, you know, the way it's set up right now, it's pretty wide across as opposed to that. That one's pretty, like, not as wide. So, yeah. I have more work for me ahead of me. And I'll be doing that tomorrow. Um, so I can do this at night when my boyfriend goes to bed. So, in case you're wondering why I'm so quiet, it's because I'm trying to be quiet because he's sleeping right now. So, yeah. Okay. I think it's time for me to go to bed. Good night, guys. So there is a spy among the bath bombs. Can you spot the spy? The one that is not a bath bomb, but something else. It is this one right here. It's the sunflower. You are a bubble bar, so out you go. And I'm going to add the, gold, the giant golden wonder, the giant rose bombshell, and the turtle one that I can't remember. So I'll probably add it up here somewhere. 
This little guy doesn't belong here as well. So, out you go. So, I am doing the bath bombs tonight. And at first, I was sitting. Um, I was going through all the bath bombs. But I just can't. I don't have that reach. So, by the time I get here, it feels a little bit skewed. Um, so, I decide that for the next one, I'm just going to just kneel. I was running out of room, so I just pushed all the products way back over there. And I also remembered that I have this one. This is Grease Lightning Spot Treatment. So now I have more room to add more stuff below. So I haven't recorded this in three days, but I just finished the soaps and it's already late. I started really late. I started maybe like around 1.30. And look, the cat already got into all my stuff, as you can see. <laughs> there are a few bottles that are tipped over and that empty spot. I just took that lotion downstairs, you know, just for now so I can use it. Um, I haven't been able to use any of the stuff for, I don't know, maybe about a week, maybe less than a week or something because I had it all upstairs and I was just waiting to use them when I was done filming this. But I wanted some lotion, so I grabbed one and brought it downstairs. These three wash cards, I am definitely going to be using them up this year. You won't see this, uh, see them in the video next year. Uh, what else? <laughs> Which is the one I don't care for? This is the soap I don't like. It smells medicinal to me. This thirteen unlucky for dirt. Um, do, do, do. Is there anything else I want to talk about regarding the soaps? Oh, um, I do have a couple of 2016 soaps, and the reason why I haven't used them is because they have not come out um, at all um, during the season, um, the past Christmas seasons. So I've held on to them, but you know it's been long enough, so I'll use them up. Kind of sad, but I don't want to have all these older items in my collection because I want to use them up, and it's been it's going to be three years, so. I have to use them up. So all the two th ugh, all the 2016 stuff's definitely going to be gone. And that includes bath bombs. I think I do have a couple of 2016s. Um, what else? I think that's it. And I will work on getting rid of 2017s as well. do have a couple, but not as many as 2018, obviously. So I'm not really, I'm not really paying attention to what I'm panning here with my camera. I'm such an idiot. I was fixing the sheets on this end and I was kneeling and guess who, guess where my knee was um, kneeling on? It was kneeling on this little calm bath bomb and now it's nicely crushed. I, I heard it. I didn't feel it as much as I heard it and look at that. I guess I'm not going to be doing a demo of this anytime soon. <laughs> oh gosh, look at that. Yeah, I totally ruined this one. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? Don't mess up my stuff. <laughs> Hello? She's not paying attention to me. She's ignoring me. She'll do as she pleases. And set her caboose right there in the middle of my stuff. Oh. Now she's going to take a nap. And I feel so bad because she came upstairs and then... I'll be going downstairs pretty soon, actually. I'm just setting up some of the bath bombs. Not bath bombs, bubble bars. Look at that. They used to be blue. Now it's like almost white. Here's another one that lost its blue color. I noticed that a lot of the blue colored um, bubble bars have lost their pretty color. And they turn into this very, uh, I don't like it, like a blue tint. So it's, they're not as pretty to look at anymore. Alright, I just finished recording the last bit of this Lush Collection video. So I hope to post this video within, I don't know, a week or two. Probably two because I am pretty lazy right now. If you haven't noticed, I haven't really been posting videos. Um, yeah, so it's pretty late. It's almost 3.30 in the morning. But I'm so glad this is done and I don't have to do this again until the following year. So hopefully next year I won't be having this many stuff because seriously, where am I going to put all of them? You know, I mean, I'm running out of space. I think I already did run out of space. 
So this is going to be really interesting um, how this is going to play out this entire year. And maybe I might even take my boyfriend up on his offer and have him use a bunch of his products. Yeah, alright, so I'm gonna go to bed. See you guys later.